For the first time in eight years, Knoxville voters will elect a new mayor. Madeline Rojero has served two terms. A half dozen people are competing for that job in August. That's the primary and the regular election. That's in November. We will hear from each of them in a series of interviews over the coming weeks. Candidate Eddie Manis leads us off. And Eddie, good to see you. Let's start with your background and what prepared you for this job. Sure, John. Thank you. It's good to be here. You, you know, it's I uh, am a native North Knoxville. You know, I've been in Knoxville all my life, and and I graduated from Central High School. And I started my company in 1985, Prestige Cleaners, and we started with three employees, and started from the ground up. And so I built a company. Uh, well, like I said, with three employees. Today, company-wide, we have 168 employees. And so I know what it takes to start a business. I know what it's like to really keep a business going. Obviously, I've, I've struggled through many budgets, uh, making payrolls, uh, and, and had to struggle to, at occasions to make payrolls and, and you know pay bills. So I think the business side of me is really important in city government. And, and people can say all the time, you can't run government like a business, but at the executive level of government, I think you can run it more like a business. And it is, it is a, a lot of financial, it's a lot of employees, it's team building. And so I think that is, uh, certainly has prepared me uh, to be the next mayor of the city of Knoxville. And then I served uh, for two years, early 2011. I was actually there for the transition uh, when Mayor Rojero came in office and I served as the chief operating officer and deputy to the mayor uh, from 2011 until 2013. And so uh, as the chief operating officer, everything from an operational standpoint reported to me, including the finance department. So uh, I think those, that experience has really prepared me very well to be the next mayor of the city. What will be your biggest priority as mayor of Knoxville? I, I think Knoxville, you know, we all think, we all say that Knoxville is a great city to live in, and it is. The quality of life here is amazing. It truly is amazing. I think, I, I know that my focus, one of my top priorities will be focusing on economic development and job growth. Uh, nothing really works in a city unless you have economic development and job growth. And I think that we need to really focus on that and, and really recruit companies to come in from the outside, but do a better job taking care of those, those entrepreneurs that we have here. And uh, we will place an intentional focus on minority entrepreneurship, uh, female entrepreneurs, and then veteran-owned businesses. Lastly, in only about 30 seconds, but what do you think is the biggest challenge facing the city of Knoxville? I, th I think there's a lot of challenges, but I think Recode might, might be one of the biggest challenges facing the city of Knoxville right now, whether that gets passed you know, before the next administration. And then the opioid crisis we have, crime and the opioid crisis we have, I think will be big challenges for the future of Knoxville. We'll dig in to those challenges a little bit more in a future interview. Eddie, we appreciate your time. Yeah, thanks, John. Thanks a for having me. Absolutely.